What's going on guys, Archie one and uh, I was asked to do a little review. Um, this is a PS4 controller. Yep, it's the uh, DualShock 4. Uh, I went to GameStop today and picked this thing up. Uh, it, they're having for sale. I mean, I don't know uh, if you guys knew that or not, but I needed a new controller. I just I was wanting a new one. I'm this close to the PS4 releasing. I really didn't want to go out and buy a new PS3 controller. So I went ahead and picked up this bad boy and uh, asked him if it worked on the PS3. He said, yeah. The only thing that doesn't work on the PS3 is the uh, PS button. You can't go to the home page via that, so you have to use a uh, second controller like that. Um, but I love the uh, love the sticks, man. They uh, the the concave slightly. They're they're nice. They don't let your your fingers slip off like the uh, the other ones did. When they get wore out, I'm sure they'll still uh, you'll still be able to get some type of grip on them. But they work really good. Buttons are all the same. Um, another nice little thing is the texture on the back side. You can kind of see how it goes from uh, a glossy finish here, which is kind of like the old ones, which got slick if you have sweaty hands like I do, to the uh, kind of a grainier finish, a little more texture to it. It's uh, it's pretty nice. Uh, it's got a touch pad on the, in the front here. I don't know what we're going to be using that for with the uh, PlayStation 4, but uh, you know, certain games I'm sure are going to have something to do with it. There's a speaker in the middle, which also doesn't work with the PS3. There's a jack in the middle, just like uh, you would have on your Xbox controller for the uh, mics and uh, talking on uh, through uh, game chat. Um, the top, the buttons here, the R1, R L1, R2, R L2, they're, uh, I can't get a little, the light's kind of bad. Anyway, um, they're good, they feel great. I mean, they got a nice, uh, they're, they're, they're kind of curved a little bit so your finger fits on them a little better. They also have a little more uh, texture on them also. Uh, you can see the light on the front there. And where the cable plugs in. Now this cable is a lot like the, uh, I would say, my, my Galaxy S3 phone. It's not like the USB cables that you would normally think of. So if you do get one of these, you're going to have to use probably your phone charger cable in order to plug it into the PlayStation. The other thing that is kind of bad about it is uh, it, it won't work wirelessly with the PS3, which is fine. Because like I said, once the PS4 gets here, it's not going to matter anyway. Um, but yeah, it's a... Uh, it's it's nice. I like it. It's uh, it feels pretty good. You know, I was gonna set it down, kind of compare the size between the uh, the old one and the new one. As you can tell, I had some grippets on my controller, kind of give me a little better grip. Those things work, by the way. I picked them up at Hastings. You can probably get them at a Game Stop or something like that, any kind of game store. But you kind of see the you know the size difference. They do kind of angle out a little bit more. They're a little bit uh, bulkier in the hand, which is kind of nice. These are kind of small even for my hands, but better than the Xbox in my my opinion. Um, but that's my opinion. Like I said, you guys, the Xbox guys, there's nothing wrong with your controller. I just don't prefer it. Uh, but anyway, you know, it's a little wider. You can kind of tell. So, yeah, so that's my review. I'm going to show you gameplay on uh, Black Ops 1 I got earlier today. Just a real quick uh, Summit gameplay. I used the controller with it. Uh, like I said, you have to have it plugged into the PS3 in order for it to work. Other than that, it works just like the old PS3 controller, so... Anyway, enjoy the gameplay. I will talk to you guys later. If you liked it, hit that like button. And if you haven't said, please do so. If there's anything else you want to know about it, leave a comment in the comments below. I'll talk to you guys later. Hurt you for one. I'm out. Okay, so I'm, I'm kind of an idiot. <laughs> I guess I could have showed you it working on the uh, on the PlayStation. Over here you can see my Elgato's recording, and I'm not even doing anything. So it's going to record this. Sweet. Uh, there's my TV. Woo, look at the setup, guys. You like that? Um, I'm trying to get the... God dang. Here we go. Sorry about this. I want to get the controller kind of in this. I don't know if I can or not. But uh, you can see. There you go. It's the PS4 controller working on the PS3. In case you guys were curious. There you go. You're welcome. Alright, now I'll talk to you guys. I'll, I'll probably do a little commentary in the, uh, um, during the summit video. I'll talk to you guys in a minute. Later. All right, guys. So yeah, I, I I had heard that you could get the PlayStation 4 controller early. I didn't watch the video. A couple of people, I guess, had done one, like how to get one early. Um, to be honest with you, I just walked into GameStop and was like, "Hey, uh, do you guys have uh, the PS3 or PS4 controllers? And when are they going on sale? Are they going on sale before the PlayStation comes out, or do we have to wait till the launch date?" And uh, the guy just basically said, "Yeah, man, he's like uh, they're for sale right now." And, uh, I guess it's like a promotional deal. So I said, does it work on the PlayStation 3? He said, yeah, it works on the PlayStation 3, except for the PlayStation button, the PS button, uh, which I showed you guys. So uh, I said, yeah, shit, well, I, I need a new controller. And uh, I had a couple other controllers I needed to get rid of anyway because they're just old. 
not the one you saw in the in the video, but a couple other ones. And uh, yeah, I decided to use those for uh, trading value. And now, now the P PlayStation 4 controller is uh, 60 freaking dollars. <laughs> it's not cheap, but it's a new controller, and I guess it's gonna because it has all that extra stuff on it. Um, you know, it's 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 gonna be an expense. That's all there is to it. You know, if you're gonna play buy, buy the uh, new PS4 anyway, you're looking at spending uh, 300 bucks on that. <laughs> Plus the uh, game that you want, if it's Ghost or Battlefield or both, you're looking at another uh, anywhere from 60 to 120 dollars. And if you get the stupid DLC pack for Ghost, which I'm getting the DLC pack for Battlefield 4, just because I like Battlefield, and that, I'm, I have a feeling Battlefield is going to really be a good game this year. I really do, and I think Ghost is going to bomb. So I'm not spending any more money on Ghost than I have to. I'm just getting the game and uh, playing it, and that's yeah, it. And that's all there is to it. Um, but yeah, I mean, as far as the controller, get back on track with the controller. I, I like it. I think it feels great. It's it's a little bigger in my hands, which is good. Uh, the old one, the old PS3 controllers were kind of small, especially for bigger guys. You know, they have bigger hands, and uh, that that was a big complaint with a lot of people. Uh, these seem to be a little thicker. They're not much wider than the old controller, but these seem to be a little thicker, which is good. Uh, which you know gives you something extra to grab onto, but it's not so big that the you know you girls or guys even with dainty hands uh, won't be able to hold on to it. And this gameplay looks like it's going to be a sad gameplay, but it's actually not. That I think was my last death. I might have one more death. I go on kind of a killing spree here in a minute. I go uh, this uh you know I'm not even going to run it. Just uh you know watch it to the end if you really want to know what happens. <laughs> uh, you might hear my buddy Wonder look in the background. He's a fellow. Uh, Air Force buddy of mine and uh, we put it, we were playing on this night. This is a theater mode, so anyway. So yeah, I mean I like the controller. I think it's great. I, like I said, I don't know what the touchpad's gonna be like. I don't know if it's a, a touchpad where you'd run your fingers across it like on the back of the uh, Vita, uh, but it's actually a button you can press down on it. So I don't know if you you know drag your finger across it and then press down to like a touchpad kind of deal like that, or if it's just a if it's just a big ass button in the middle. Uh, I don't know. I know the P PlayStation 4 is going to have the uh, cross-game chat, so if I'm playing Battlefield 4 and say, for instance, Omen there, <laughs> who uh, will leave you guys a nice little message in a minute, um, is playing on Call of Duty, uh, we might be able to have like a, a little chat you know, while I'm playing one game, he's playing another, So, uh, which will be nice. And that's what that little jack in the front of the controller was for. It looks exactly like the uh, Xbox controller, to be honest with you. And I have an Xbox controller laying around here. I just decided... I didn't, get it out to compare the size you guys know the difference but it's it doesn't even matter but yeah so I mean I like it I, I, I played it with it for a couple hours tonight I played uh, Call of Duty Black Ops with my buddy here I got this gameplay and then we switched over to Battlefield because another buddy of mine was on Battlefield so uh, we played for about I don't know two two and a half three hours on Battlefield and I used that control the whole time and it just it worked flawlessly it worked just like the old ones like you know the PS3 controllers um, the uh, the sticks felt stiffer. I don't know if that was just because the sticks on my old controller were loose from being used and tossed around and slammed on the floor so much, or what. Uh, but they just felt a little uh, stiffer, which is good. I mean, it, there you go. Hi, you two. Tell, tell Omen hi, everybody. Say hi. Hi, Omen. Um, like I said, I don't know if they uh, just felt stiffer because it's a new controller or if they actually tightened them down. I'd heard rumor that they actually tightened them down. So I, I don't know. I hope that's hope that's the case. So I almost died there trying to get my dog, so I'd have been pissed. But yeah, so uh, yeah, I, I like it. Like I said, oh, and, and I don't know if it was uh, just a fluke that I got a hold of one or what, but I'm glad I did. Like I said, I, I needed a new controller, and I didn't want to buy a new PS3 controller uh, with the PS4 coming out so soon. And you do have to run it wired. Uh, I tried wireless; it does not work wireless with the PlayStation 3. So you have to run a wire with it in order to get it to work with the PlayStation uh, 3. But Nevertheless, I mean, I, I got an extension cord, so it didn't matter. And the wire is not your typical, it's not the same connection as your PS3. I had to use, like I said, I had to use my, uh, um, I had to use my, my phone went off. Speaking of phone, I had to use my phone wire uh, charging cable to actually uh, hook up my, uh, the PS4 controller to it. So, anyway, this gameplay is winding down, guys. If you like the commentary, please hit that like button. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below, and I'll do the best I can to answer them. Uh, other than that, this is your boy, Hurt Chief one and I am... Out. Friendly care package on the way. That's how it's done. Nice job. I like it.